have everyone? Everybody safe? Yeah, everyone except Nurm. Duh, can't believe you left him behind for some useless llama. She's not some useless llama. Looks pretty useless to me. Stop it! You're hurting her feelings! Nurm wanted to stay, Jack. You have to respect that. Well, you should have stopped him! There's a whole world down here. The first world. Created by us. Romeo, Fred, and me. Haven't seen it since I was imprisoned. Before he bedrocked over it all. You made this? Not this. This shadow. The view from up here. It'd be hard to see your world like this. How long have you been gone, exactly? No idea. It's hard to keep track of the time in maximum security. Long enough for the world to change. I knew what Romeo planned to do. But still, seeing it like this... Romeo? The admin. Oh! It's worse than I imagined. This is the room where he killed Fred. I watched it happen. We refused to join him and... It was... slow. He needs to be stopped. That's why we're here. He hurt you, and he'll hurt more people. I wonder if he had a heart at all. Or... he was just a monster pretending to play along. Fred's keep is that way. Want to defeat Romeo? The weapon's in there. That sounded vaguely ominous. Is that...? That is the biggest Enderman I've ever seen. Romeo never could leave well enough alone. He liked toying with the basic order of things. It would be great if I could go one day just one day without seeing something new and completely terrifying! So that thing is another admin created monstrosity. Time to move, guys. <gasps> so mesmerizing. Not in the eyes, Radar. Don't look at its eyes! <gasps> Sorry, Jesse! What happened? It was just hypnotic! So big! And glowy! Go! Go! Glowing! Thank you, Luna. It's dismantling the tower! the way. Fred's keep lies just on the other side, and we'll have some cover from that thing. What? Do, do you guys see? Jesse, we gotta go.
this safe? I mean, you know, not asking for me, because because I'm tough. Whatever. Our defenses are impressive. State-of-the-art machinery, automated farming. The Oasis is a completely self-sustaining city. It's... home? So sorry, I can only imagine if I saw Beacon Town like this. Save your pity. Wait, this is your town? What has he done to it? Hang on, I just need to see if it's still here. We have to keep moving. No telling what the admin is up to in Beacon Town, and they'll all think it's me. Oh, get out of here, you walking carpet! <laughs> Eat yourself! You, uh. Okay there, Jack? No, this dumb stack of wool won't leave me alone. <clears throat> Disgusting spit everywhere, not good for anything. No useful skills, can't make maps, no sense of humor. Terrible conversationalist. Hey, I get that you're upset, but would you stop taking it out on the poor llama, please? I do, I... Oh, I just, I want to... I'm sorry. I think I let my mighty emotions get the better of me there. Sorry, Luna. We will get Nurm back, Jack. I don't know how yet, but we're not going to forget him. Yeah, I, uh, I appreciate that, Jesse. Years without sleep! Years! <laughs> Only rest is at home. Won't rest until I get there, I said! Zara? <laughs> Look at this! My bed! Come on! She's freaking out about a bed? Really? Could she be any more melodramatic? <laughs> wow. Come on, guys. Be nice. I'm being as nice as I possibly can. No, no, you're right. Sorry, Jesse. I just wanted to sleep. I thought if I could find this one thing, one last thing still whole, there's no hope for this place. I'll never get it back now. He made sure. He won't get away with this. We'll get back at the admin for what he did. We'll avenge your, your... your bed. You really believe that, don't you? Zara, what are you doing over here by this, uh... It's a portal. What? The portal. Broken now like everything else. Just leave me here. Go. You want to destroy Romeo, don't you? Make him pay for what he did to you, your town? Then you have to get up. Not much use stuck down here. But what about the portal? Where does it go, anyway? Nowhere, obviously. It's broken. We built these so we could visit each other. An object in the frame would teleport you to the owner. My idea, by the way. Though Romeo took credit for it. Fred wanted to add the birch. He loved birch. So you'd know how to rebuild it. And get us up to the admin. I don't know if I can. Come on, Zara, if you built it once, you can build it again. You're the best inventor in the... underneath. Probably the only inventor now. Even... better? I don't get it. How do you keep going? Look where you are, but you're still fighting. Why? The admin hurt the people I care about. Nobody gets away with that. Nobody. So I'm finding Fred's weapon and taking him down. Fine. It won't work without a personal object. Something with a strong bond to Romeo to take us right to him. Though an object crafted on the surface could do in a pinch. Let me worry about finding an object for the portal. You just focus on getting it running. Follow the tracks. They'll lead you to Fred's keep. Whatever Fred found, he hid it at home. That's what he told me. Jesse! 
Go. I'll see what I can do. where we'll find the weapon. Kind of useless, unless we can find a way out of here. Can't exactly go back up through that prison. Zara's got it covered. Oh, great. Just what this place needed. Run on ahead! making introductions right now? <laughs> We've been scavenging these lands since the darkness fell. You know what? We can sniff out an outsider when we sniff one. So what are you doing all the way down here, small fry? You lost? We're here to take down the admin. <laughs> You're kidding! You can't even make it off this gravel cliff by yourself! <laughs> maybe we help you, maybe we just walk away. Leave you here to die! The first one! Pick the first one! I don't know. Seems like a lot of work. Getting down there, pulling you up. Help us and we may surprise you? When's the last time you met someone new down here? Not a fan of surprises, especially since the last one. Things do get pretty boring down here, though. Here's the thing, folks. Down here, we don't do anything for free. Can't really blame us, what with the giant monsters and nothing growing. So, how about we take your inventory for a spin permanently? We're really interested in any weaponry you may have. A warrior without their sword in a place like this is dead meat! Your friend doesn't look like he's gonna last much longer. What'll it be? Don't do it, Jesse. We can find another way. Your swords? Or splat! Flatter than a lily pad at the bottom of this canyon. <laughs> splat. Ooh. No deal! Yeah, well that's... disappointing. <laughs> yeah, we'll go our own way. Don't go playing heroes, Squishies! Well, this dark will snuff out a light like you real fast! Jack! Jesse! Jack! Eh, tried to tell ya! <laughs> Move out, ya stink bags! Jack! Was worth it. 
<laughs> See ya! Jesse! Oh, I'm so glad you're okay. Where's Jack? He didn't make it. So sorry, this is all my fault if I hadn't. No, Jesse, this isn't on you. You said it was an accident. That means it could have happened to anyone. Wait, what about Luna? What about her? <laughs> She's a treasure sniffing llama, right? Treasure sniffing, not jack sniffing. I don't think Luna would be much help here. Yes, this is how they keep the mobs out. Strangers! Strangers! Binta! What do we do here, Jesse? Well, hey, we're not strangers. We're, we're visitors coming to visit, you know, like visitors do. That makes no sense. No one visits us. Uh, makes sense, I guess. I've never seen you before, and, and I know everyone. Everyone in the underneath. Binta! She's not coming back, is she? Someone in there has to know where that weapon is. Let's go. Careful. They might be well armed, and now they know we're coming. Have been returned. Festivities will close with a fireworks display as usual. And don't forget to sign up for our Faithful Friends of Fred trivia competition for a chance to win one night in Fred's house. Come on, people. We can't let Kent win every time, can we? Study up. Competition starts at Fred o'clock. Why did I say that? They're having a trivia contest? Doesn't that seem a little silly? Silly? They're trapped underground with a bunch of monsters. Hey, we just got here. We have no right to judge them. Okay, sorry. I think it's kind of nice. Welcome to Fred's Keep. My name is Binta. This is the part where you tell me why you're here. We're looking for a weapon that belonged to Fred. It's supposed to be hidden in his home. Maybe we could take a look? Fred's house is sacred and locked. No one enters unless they win the contest. No one. It's how we honor Fred. Even I only enter through its doors on special occasions. Most of my townspeople have never even been inside. You have to help me, this is important. I don't have to do anything for you, outsider. The door is locked until the contest is won. No amount of arguing will change that. Fred built this place, made it safe from all the monsters out there. This is his legacy, his final request. I'm not breaking my promise to him. You're welcome to try your luck. See how well you know Fred. I don't know him very well at all. I, I've never met him. Guess you better start researching. Good luck. This place is weird. Nice! What are you up to? Uh, uh huh? Uh, uh, oh. Just trying to figure out if, if there's a better way into Fred's house than, well, 
studying, just in case. Hey, um, Jesse? Yeah? Do you think Radar still thinks... I don't know. Uh, I feel like everyone's looking at me differently. You noticed it too, right? He's being weird with me. Like, like he thinks I'm still... still with the admin or something. Hey, I know you better than anyone, right? You're still the same Petra you've always been. <laughs> Hard-headed? <laughs> Thanks, Jesse. That makes me feel better. Just had to, you know, make sure I wasn't the only one who noticed. So... So you're the one! The one who thinks they can beat me as a faithful friend of Fred. Hey, dude. And I'll tell you something, stranger. I am the most faithful friend of Fred, which means I always win. And that means you will lose. So good luck. I don't even know what to do with that one. Hi, um... Oh, you want to know something about Fred? Uh, yeah, actually. How did you... His favorite tool? A diamond hoe. That's why I use two. And why I take farming my mushrooms super, super seriously. For serious. Cool. Yeah, sure. Makes sense. Uh, bye. <laughs> <laughs> 